All right, guys, gonna do something a little different today. Um, I'm gonna open a legendary troll loot truck, legendary troll stash, and an into the storm llama, and hopefully have some good luck. Let's see what happens. Let's start off with the legendary troll loot truck. All right, as you know, these always go gold. Hopefully some good luck here. Looks like I'm going to be able to open uh, another Into the Storm Llama. Nothing great so far. Well, lights are okay, but I already have a better version of those. I have to see what the rolls are on them, though. Uh, let's go with the Sith. Well, if I knew that, I wouldn't have picked it the first time. Not impressed, no legendary so far. A little disappointing. Hopefully at least one. A lot of survivors. Okay, Super Shredder's nice. The last one I got had really bad rolls on it. I did need the wall spikes. Very happy with that. I have a ceiling zapper, but let's see what the rolls are on these things. Not bad. I wish I had a little crit chance on it. The Super Shredder is what I'm really interested in. Eh, another another Super Shredder with bad rolls. Eh, what are you going to do? This is actually decent. This actually, I like this. The Socket Slugger looks pretty good. Storm Chaser's Revenge. Eh. No element on it. Let me see here. You think with the name of Storm Chaser, it'd have some sort of element on it, but anyway. Let's head over to the legendary Troll Stash. Aha, uh, bring us the buckles. Leave. These also always hey, turn gold. Rich as a pharaoh. Still not impressed so far. Another floor launcher. Looks like... Okay, Stormblade. I like that. I have a decent one right now. Let's see if the one that I just got is any better. Crit chance. Damage chance. That's not bad. I mean... We have some electric damage on that. And also... Really, really high chance to crit, so uh, I'm liking that. I think I'm going to end up switching swords here. I'm going to switch in my Storm Blades over from the one I'm using to this. So that wasn't a bad uh, haul out of that one. Now, I'm not sure how many Into the Storm Llamas I'm going to be open here. It looks like three. Let's see how I do here. You know, I love the looks of these. The camels of the sky. They did a really nice job. Loving the awesome. brightly green colored neon rope. I'm really hoping for the neon sword out of one of these. At least the legendary version. Ted shot, Jess, nice. Ooh, nice sledgehammer. Alright, like in the Ted shot, Jess. I have a lot of soldiers, so let's go Constructor. I have a Tank Penny, so no good so far. No Legendaries. Gotta love the classics. 
All right, it's the third time the charm. Let's see. Remember me. Needed a pistol. I'm really kind of sad though. Nothing was legendary popping, but let's see how we did here. Copper Krypton pistol. Energized rounds. That's pretty cool. Good rolls. I wish it was legendary, though. I like in all of the damage that it has, especially uh, the headshot damage there. Reload speed's always nice. Really nice roll on this pistol. Assault Rifle Neon. Let's see here. This one also does energy damage. Wow, a lot of headshot damage on this. Wish it was legendary, but I'll take it. Ted shot Jess. Not really sure what she does yet. Let's, let's let's take a look if they let me. It's not looking like they... Okay. I was able to get it over there. Okay, she's the one that uses the sniper rifle. That's what it looks like. So I'm going to have to grab that sniper rifle from the shop. Quick scope increases sniper rifle rate of fire by 35%. That's nice. Every 15 headshot kills grant one charge fragment. All right, cool. I'm liking her. She might be uh, my new my new outlander here just because she uses that sniper rifle from the shop and it's something different. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Um, I appreciate it, and please like and subscribe.